So let's take a look at how to use JSON specific function in PostgreSQL database. So first thing, make sure that you are running PostgreSQL service in the background. On Windows, I can simply run this service and then open PSQL shell and run my commands. Also, you can use command prompt and run this code as well. So first thing, let's check out the available set of database then choose one, okay? And here I have one table that contains the JSON data, okay? So to check the JSON data, I'm simply selecting entire table, okay? And here you see I have this ID with info column that has JSON data. Now there are three functions that I want to show you. First being JSON each, so select, and then JSON underscore each, and with info inside, and then taking the entries from contacts. Semicolon. And here you see, JSON each will show you this key value pair where you have name and it's value, then age, then value, and so on, okay? This will just goes to show you the key value pairs within your JSON data, okay? Similarly, you can also use JSON object keys to list out the list of keys within your data. So select JSON underscore object underscore keys. And here you can check for a specific column where you have JSON data from your table. So my colon to end and run the query. And you see list of objects, name age, name age, total eight rows. Okay, so that list of objects is retrieved through this key. Okay, so this query is for listing specific keys from your JSON data, okay? You can specify, let's say, if you have data within your, let's say, name with multiple data within that, so that nested data can be taken as well. But my table currently does not have such nested data, so I'm gonna avoid that, okay? So let's go ahead with one more query. Here, I can also check for the type of data within my JSON. Okay, so let's go with JSON underscore type of. I want to check whether it's string, object, array, or not. Okay, so JSON type of, and then info, then from contacts. Okay, and you see, all of these are treated as object and not string or array or none. Okay, so we take a look at three queries. One is JSON underscore each, which checks for key value pair, then JSON object keys that checks for your specific object within that key value pair. Okay, it points you out to that. So name and age being those objects, okay? Finally, JSON type of goes to show you what type of data you have, such as null, array, string, or object, and you get the output respectively.